Hey, welcome to day four of the Happy Hand series. On Monday, we talked about hand placement in the handstand. On Tuesday, we talked about keeping your elbows locked out so you don't fall on your head. <laughs> Yesterday, Nicole talked about an active shoulder position. The next thing we want to address in our self-checklist for the handstand is the core. <laughs> Yesterday, Nicole had me put my hands up in the air like I just don't care and made me hold them there for a really long time. I was actually sweating pretty bad. But let's take a look at that position again. Nicole's gonna face me and put her hands up overhead, and she's gonna have a nice open angle on the shoulder here, okay? So what tends to happen with some athletes is they'll pick their ribs up and flare them out to get their hands overhead. Can you show them what that looks like? So now she's overextended in this position. Now there's a lot of load. If we were to load this, there'd be a lot of load on her lower back, which is no bueno. What I want Nicole to do is when I say contract your core, I want her to squeeze her abs so that her ribs come down and now we have a nice straight line from her fingertips all the way down. So when we say core, this is what we're talking about here. We want to make sure the middle piece here is nice and in line and everything is together. Again, the shoulder flexibility is going to affect this position. This is what we want, ideally. This is what we want it to look like. All right, guys, so as we go through the rest of the series, we want you to be mindful about keeping your abs tight. Some of you might actually assume that overextended position because it feels more stable. And the reason why it feels more stable is that your bones are actually touching each other. So it kind of creates this illusion of stability, but that's not the kind of stability we want to create. You can actually cause bone fractures that way. It's called spondylolisthesis, right? It's no bueno, you don't want that. So think about your abs down, keeping everything nice and tight, like I'm gonna come punch you in the stomach. Have fun with this, guys, we'll see you tomorrow.